So we were talking about love and you had some conflict, you know, with the work that you're doing with your mother, you want love from your mother um, and so on. She's a very weak person. But what you're saying to me, this is what I'm hearing anyway. I want love from my mother. Yes, got it. Don't we all? Yes, yes, yes. And I want it on my terms. Yes. Okay. All right. Uh, and that latter part, well, first of all, the former part, I want love from my mother, is there's an error in that, although a very understandable error. That's what we do as humans, okay? We want love from other people. We want love from outside. It's a mistake. It's an error because when we look for love outside of ourselves, we're ignoring the fact that the real love comes from inside of ourselves, Mm. You're sort of nodding your head saying, well, maybe. <laughs> no, 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 it's true. It's true. It's, it's a huge error. Okay. So, yeah, and it's one of the more difficult things to get around. Um, but so long as you and I are looking for love outside of ourselves, we have to recognize that's what everybody else is doing as well. Okay. <laughs> there, people are looking for love from you and by the way whether they realize it or not they're doing it on their terms mm -hmm. they want love on their terms alright yeah 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 that's a, that's a good point I never thought about that but it's well, true yeah. well let me give you a little example I, I learned what I'm going to tell you a few decades ago um and I didn't understand it in the early part of my life when I was had girlfriends and I was married and look, falling in love and all of that. Okay. What we tend to do as people um, is we look for love outside ourselves. But when I say on our terms, we tend to lead with one of our main senses. 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 The main ones are seeing hearing and feeling okay those are the main senses all right so some people want to hear it i love you you know and they want to hear sweet sweet things somebody makes them a poem or sings them a song they're hearing it okay i love you in various forms it's being told to them they're getting it through their primarily through their auditory sense okay now, when I was married, I didn't realize it, but that's what my wife wanted. That was her main thing. All right? My main thing wasn't that. If you want to exhibit love to me, you can tell me you love me all day long, and it counts. But the big one is you've got to touch me. And I'm not talking necessarily about the sexual part of it. I'm talking about holding my hand, rubbing my shoulders. Well, as you walk across me in the living room, you rub your hand against my back or something. You know, a, a touch, a touch. That's how you communicate that to me. You touch me. It's a kinesthetic feeling. Mm. And so my, but my wife would put it out in the way that she wants it, which is to be heard. She would tell me that all day long. I love you. Da, da. And my self-talk would be, well, okay, so touch me. All right. But she couldn't care less about the touching part of it. She didn't. <laughs> In fact, I, I would go up behind her and I would, well, she was cooking breakfast or something like that. And I'd put my hands on her shoulders and I'd rub her shoulders and, and, and pat her on the bottom and all kinds of stuff like that. You know, <laughs> little tender touches. And she'd say, not now, not now, not now. <laughs> and you were showing it the way you wanted. Yes, yes. And so we were missing. And most people miss. Most people, other people want to want you to show it to them. I had a girlfriend later on that she was very much into, I needed to show my affection. I need to bring her flowers, show it, bring her flowers. Uh, dress well for her, that kind of thing, okay? Mm -hmm. um, buy her something, now you show it through the eyes. All right. 
I could I couldn't care less about that. <laughs> that is so immaterial to me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but anyway, so when I say on your terms, it's not a criticism. It's something you need to observe. You observe it. And the more you can observe it, the more you are less attached to it. So for long as you're saying to yourself, I want my mother's love and I want it on my terms. And she's not even here. You're going to have yourself a little problem. Yeah. Am I right? Yes, yes, there is this control. That's true in 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 the act of like you should be like this and you should our relation should be like that and yeah, yeah I kind yeah. of tell her how she should be yeah and and you'll do that with with your romantic relationships you could probably look back at yours and and probably see that at play someplace of course yeah yeah when you first fell in love with whoever the amour was it's because he was meeting your needs in whatever ways you needed them. Yes. And yes, you were meeting yes. his. And there was probably some strong sexual component to it and maybe a financial component to it and, and a social component to it. And, you know, all kinds of things that go into. He gives me what I want. Yay. He's my <laughs> amour, okay? Okay. <laughs> And he's saying, she gives me what I want. Hooray. Well, that doesn't always last forever. People change and shift and whatever. And instead of meeting just like this beautifully on every, every you know, touching point, it ends up going like this. <laughs> you don't touch anymore. You, yeah. It, it doesn't fit quite like it used to. Okay. Because you're looking for love outside yourself if we get to a point where we don't need now there's where we don't need love outside of ourselves we can want it that's different than needing it are you with me yes okay uh, i mean i have a girlfriend i have a girlfriend i don't need the girlfriend but I enjoy her greatly, and I want the girlfriend. But if she walked out tomorrow, I'm gonna go. Oh, that's no good. Da, 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 da. You, know, you know, I'll maybe grouse around for a day or two. Um, but I'm not gonna just fall into some hole because it's something I want, not something I need. And I'm hearing from you about your mother, something that you need yes and you're not going to get because she's not here yes am i right yes all right so you can chase it all you want and you'll run into wall after wall after wall after wall until you finally recognize she's not here to give it to you and even if she was she's probably not capable of giving it to you on your terms yeah even but if I mean, she was exactly yeah yeah, yeah. 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 Exactly. And, yeah. and actually, I, I don't know your mother, but the odds are she did love you on her terms. On her terms, yeah. The, the 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 way she thought she was doing it the best she could. Yeah, I'm right. sure. But you weren't getting it because that's not your terms. Yes. I don't I don't know how if this is helping or hurting I don't know. No 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 it's really a a a, a breakthrough the there is a, a this element of of control that I kind of didn't see yeah Yeah So you you'll be batting your head against a wall the more you keep saying I want my mother's love I want my mother's love I, on my terms I, 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 I need the, the, yeah, oh, yeah, I need. Moment, it's yeah. need. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need. <laughs> I not need. even want. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. I, yeah, I, I, I need my mother. So if it really is a need, uh, good luck. <laughs> I will need it. Okay. 
Now, there's another thing you can do, and I'm forgetting now whether we did some part of this in our session. But you can, she, she passed away, I'm correct. I, yes. Yeah, okay. um, what you can do is connect with her in a loving way, actually on your terms, because you're the one doing all of this. But it's, it's a, it's a um, have a session with yourself, an unseen therapist, where you bring in, you put your mother in front of you, okay? Mm -hmm. In your imagination, you put her in front of you. And, and there she is with all her flaws and her inabilities to give you love on your term and her weaknesses and everything else. And I think we did something like this. I remember you having tears about your mother. A lot, yeah. Yeah. Um, but we start to recognize that she was doing the best she could. Yeah. And the important part of the exercise is to start developing love within yourself and share that love with her. Fill up, fill up your love sponge. Did we go over that? Not in the session, but I'm familiar with it a lot, yeah. Okay. But let Unseen Therapy help you fill your love sponge as you look at your mother, understanding she did not know how to give you love on your terms. Yeah, yeah. It kind of seems more and more clear that she was giving me love, but I didn't recognize it. Yeah. Okay. Well, but in this exercise, you would spend time with her and you would fill up her dry love sponge. Because as I recall it, she had a, a not too loving background herself. Yes, exactly. Okay. Fill up her love sponge. And then the two of you, in your imagination, spend time sharing love with each other. Sharing love with each other. But see, you're, the important part is you are developing it within yourself and sharing it with her because she's the... She also needs it, if you will. She also needs it, exactly. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Um, but just spend time sharing that with her in your imagination. Um, and the more the more dramatically you can do that, um, the more likely it is you'll start to develop the idea I know I don't need it from her. I need it for me, and you can get it from her by giving it to her. Okay. Yeah. I hope that, that sounds didn't... wonderful. Oh, does it? Okay. Well, you got it recorded. Okay. Yeah, that's why I'm not even taking notes because it's recorded. But it's it sounds wonderful. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's a that's a biggie. You're not the only one to deal with it. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, you know, join the parade. <laughs> But if you can get there, or to the extent you can get there, uh, that's a really big part of climbing our stairway to miracles. Yes. To get to that one place where I don't, the love's got to come, come from within, not from without. Yes, 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 absolutely. Yeah, that's, this exercise sounds wonderful, really. All right. So, yes, and, and, uh, also, you know, like uh, we spoke, uh, if I'm not correct, uh, Monday, Tuesday, and and today is Sunday, you know, when we had a session, and and so much, uh, like so much progress has been done already. I tried to do it, you know, every day a little bit, and and uh, really, I'm I'm so so grateful for for your help, uh, because I've been advancing so much with this and uh, and the volcano. Oh. It's wonderful. It was such a wonderful way to um, kind of move something that was stubborn. You know, yeah. it was a wonderful way to kind of uh, um, smooth it out. Yeah, yeah. okay. Uh, in our next webinar, I may do some version of the volcano for everybody. Okay. Uh, it'll depend on our time, but but I think I'll have time for it. 
Okay. Yeah, it's kind, it's okay. kind of a fun, kind of a fun metaphor too. You know, you float in a cloud above a volcano. <laughs> yeah, it, but really, I think also the very good part, at least for me, is also the disassociation. That it's like it's there, but I'm with unseen therapist. You know, I'm not kind of involved in it. I see it when when the rain falls. I feel the change happening. But somehow it's a safe space, you know, it's very it's beautiful. It's, uh, um, it was because, just, for me, because, it was just wonderful, really. If I recall it right, we ended up when we did the volcano with you, something I, I never even thought about before, but it just showed up with your session and that is that the lava turned into a play it was a playground or a meadow yes. or a, par a playground yes yes okay. yes yes yeah and, and before it wasn't that but here it came it came, became a playground and now you can uh, uh, it's, a, it's a really really good way to to kind of end it i i haven't gotten to that part yet uh it it's it's still kind of clearing and uh, I'm, uh, I think I'm getting kind of closer to there, you know, when there is this kind of reconciliation and, and, and the playground together. So yeah, definitely. Okay. So I will, yes. Go ahead. No, no, so I will keep you posted, you know, I will do the, the exercise. I will uh, also try to kind of see it from that perspective of, uh, but first of all, the exercise, because it sounds like, it's it's it can move a lot of things in many specific events, I guess, not just not just this one. And uh, and yeah, we will definitely be in touch. You know, I will. Uh, okay. um, I will. I will keep you posted. Where where are you on the idea of using it? You know, so other people can see it and so on. Exactly. Yes. Yes. I, I like I said, I was when I spoke to you, I was in such a bad state that. I needed to kind of, you know, get out of it a little bit. I don't know if you can see, but I'm much better now. So I was kind of, uh, uh, you know, being able to kind of think about it, and uh, I'm, I'm, I'm okay with it. I will definitely, you know, be be okay with it. I just need to look at some parts that I wanted to to move. Um, uh, you know, kind of like you said, I will give you the times. You no, know? like oh, yeah, if we could yeah. cut that apart, they just you know, small kind of personal details. Yeah. And and I will you know send it to you once I have it done and and uh, you can use it. Okay. All right. Great. Yeah. And I think and I think I think it would be very very very. You'll be helping a lot of people by allowing it. So. Okay. This comment is 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 the deciding point really. You know I uh, I, I think it's the most emotional you know kind of uh, session I've ever had. Uh, but but like you said, if it helps other people, then 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 it's it's public. It's you know it, uh, it's got to be done. You know, I and I really understand what you mean. Yeah. Yeah. Especially yeah, I, when it comes to that part. I don't know if you want to use that part about the client. Um, yeah, I I, I, I do want to start with that, but, but we, we did yeah. we didn't identify him or anything else, so you know. Exactly. Yeah. So I understand what you mean. And uh, and I have it in mind, of course, constantly, you know, that I will I kind of just look through it properly and just, you know, for those kind of few personal details just to be removed. And and uh, I will I will let you know. And I also spoke to him uh, and and I, and I think he will be open to have a session. He will, I will speak to him today. So oh, okay. All right. and, you know, I, I told him that it would be for uh, uh, training. So I, I think he'll be fine with that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Great. So that, that's great, wonderful. Great. And uh, yeah, again, thank you so much for all your help. And uh, and also like opening me up to metaphors even more, you know, it was <laughs> it was amazing for me, but also it was amazing for for kind of learning, you know, like mm -hmm. uh, what's so useful. So thank you so much for everything. Well, what you might want to do sometime when you're driving or something is just start thinking of your own metaphor. I mean, there's there's millions of metaphors out there, okay? Volcanoes and grand ballrooms and lakes of love and are just a few I came up with, but there's, yeah. you know, there's a, go find your own and you can do a lot with them, you know? Yeah, I will. I think, you know, you've made so many that I don't know if we need more, but, and they're so amazing. The car wash, I love the car wash. I love the love sponge. Uh, you know, so there are so many to use, 
that uh, I, I, you know, but I'm sorry, yeah, the, the imagination is, is endless, no? As yeah. we know, uh, the, let's, let's push the um, ceiling, no, of the beliefs. Yeah, there we go. Raise the belief ceilings, yes. Okay. Exactly, yeah. All right. Yeah. So, All really, right, thank my dear. you so much. Thank you, and I'll see thank you soon. You. Okay, bye. Bye-bye, see you.